Hey guys, I am Sam Bergstein, aka Body Knowledge 77, and in this video I'm going to share with you a proposal for a progressive powerlifting meet. That's a mouthful. I was watching the Super Train channel the other day. For those of you that are not familiar with the Super Train channel, if you're into hardcore lifting, powerlifting, and you're not subscribed, you should be. Because that channel and Jim McDonald's channel, which is associated with it, are awesome. Jim McDonald's channel in particular is like, well, lifting porn. But not in a sexual way, unless you go that way. I don't. But the main guy that's associated with both these channels is Mark Bell. Mark Bell is a legend for a number of reasons in the strength and powerlifting world. But one of the main ones in particular that's associated with this proposal of this progressive meet is he's the inventor of the slingshot. And not only do I have a proposal, but I possess props for this video. This is the slingshot that I have in my possession. For those of you that are not aware of what the slingshot is, it is something that you wear. When? When you bench. How much you bench. On your elbow bicep region, it protects your shoulders, pecs, gets you in a good position, allows you to handle heavier weight, more overload, lots of great stuff. There are four different types of slingshot. This is the original one that I have in my possession. So now I will segue to the proposal. You guys know that there are bench shirts that are utilized in meets, right? Well, maybe you didn't. They're the single ply and the multi ply. Well, why not have a category or a specific meet where slingshots are used they're popular people all around the country all around the world possess one they're cheaper than most bench shirts and they're a whole hell of a lot easier to put on than most if not all bench shirts some bench shirts you need an additional person two or three to get them on so why not I commented on one of the videos regarding it and it got a whole bunch of thumbs up so I think some people did and you never know this might actually happen the next part of the proposal this what's this some of you know what this is it's a lifting strap this proposed meet will be a push pull the bench the push the deadlift, the pull. There will be no stagger grip. The stagger grip you utilize when double overhand ain't cutting it no more. So you reinforce your grip. Won't be allowed. Extra manly, double overhand. To protect the biceps to a degree that's not applicable to everyone though. The spine a little bit more evenly loaded but also because it's a lot more manly. You gotta hold on to a double overhand, but when it gets too heavy, when you get up to those heavier attempts, you utilize straps. Strong men use them, and those guys are badass mofos. You know about them, you've seen them. In many events, they use straps. So why not in a progressive powerlifting meet? Some, some different. Sometimes different is good. Sometimes different is better. And as I say, better is vastly underrated. Thanks, guys.